What's going on, train friends? It is January 3rd, my special day. Decided to make a trip out to a few train stores that are really close by each other, including Menards, which is where I'm going first. And this is in uh, Tridelphia. There's also the Pats trains and TNK Hobby that are down in uh, Wheeling and across the, the bridge into Ohio, into Bridgeport, Ohio. So we're heading up to Menards right now and uh, we're gonna do a store walk through there. And then for the other stores, I'm gonna post videos, their own separate videos in the upcoming days. So um, stay tuned for those and- In 1,000 feet, turn right, then turn- There's the Cabela's over there. Here we are. We found the Menards. All right, here we are at Menards and you can see this place is huge. This is basically just like uh, Home Depot or Lowe's, uh, but yet they sell train stuff inside. So that's what I'm here for today. Let's go inside and check it out. So if you live by Menards, just so you know, they're having this 15% off sale. Everything you can fit in this bag is 15% off. So we're gonna go see what train stuff we can fit into this paper bag. Let's go check it out. This place is huge. You can get pretty much just about anything you can think of in here. I think I spotted the train stuff. Oh man, here's the candy. Oh, I might have to stop and get candy. Last time we were in Menards, I got, a, I got some candy. Here it is. Here's the beginning of the train stuff. This is actually one of the things I wanted to see here was some of the military stuff. It's like military flat cars. It's like a nice gondola. What else is back here? Looks like a, just a bunch of gondolas. The one with the truck's not too bad. Got a Union Pacific gondola. Norfolk and Western. So UP, I know that's Chicago Northwestern hopper. That's a nice looking hopper. What we got down here? We got some tank cars, box cars. Check out that Southern Pacific. That's pretty sick. 20 bucks, guys. Nice cars for 20 bucks. Can make up a nice train real fast with these. They're a little bit below, like low, smaller than scale, but um, tell you what, you can't beat it for that price. Check out that can Canadian hopper, that's nice. Cool. Check out this Milwaukee Road boxcar. It's pretty nice. If you're a New York Central fan, there's a nice New York Central hopper. I'm looking for any, personally, I'm looking for anything Pensy, I guess. Maybe Conrail. And over here, it looks like we got some buildings. These are HO scale buildings. These are really cool, these. The dog food factory. There's a nice big O gauge. County Suites. Little HO Gamer and Thrones. I tell you what, I've been looking at this building for a long time. This this veteran sash. It's a hundred and thirty dollars, but look at all the detail this thing has. Comes with figures, lights, and then I think even up here, like that fan will move. From what I recall, yeah, it says there it is. Two rotating exhaust fans. It does come with the lighting. Here's the um, the Menards tubular track. Basically looks just like Lionel tubular track. Feels like it's pretty good quality. 
and then you got some tank cars there's a nice Texaco tank car Western Pacific gondolas SP box car Minneapolis and St. Louis box car anything buried back there I don't see anything else buried back there here's a nice looking campground this is uh, it's a campground with a lighted truck there's the truck a lot of detail on that thing there's the Menards dog that's in every scene <laughs> there's a uh, headquarters building up there gamer and thrones those are O scale the brewery this thing's pretty cool this American materials here's a uh, FedEx building that's plugged in right now and operating with the lights on and you can see the forklift moving in and out that's pretty cool there's the dog again And then over here, look, this is a HO scale National Power and Light Company. I have this one in O gauge, except mine is uh, the American Power and Light Company and has uh, like a red, white, and blue theme. Pretty cool. Has the blinking red LEDs on the top of the transformer there. That one, like I said, that one's HO scale. And then check out these flat cars down here. These are really nice. These are basically, these are full scale. So these are, you can see these are a little bit more, but they're still really affordable. 35 bucks and you get a, a nice scale flat car with a, a wooden top and a scale truck on it. And then here's another one. This one has a dump truck on it. Really nice. Here's another one of those buildings. Here's a pretty cool looking gas station. Let's check that out. That's awesome. Comes with the truck and everything. Two tow trucks, working lights. Where's, oh, the tow, I'm oh, sorry, I said two. So, tow truck with working lights. This is like a, a thin structure you can see there. It goes basically up against the wall. Pretty neat. And uh, there's the big O scale version of the National Power and Light. That's a nice, heck of a nice building for a hundred bucks. Man, you can't beat that. Check that thing out, that's sick. I wish I had places to put some of these buildings on my layout because they're really good deals. Here's the, um, which one's this? This is a track side building. Really nice. Uh, here's a here's the the depot. Really cool. A lot of detail on that. Look at all the figures you get. A little bit of a grass scenery on there. The dog again. <clears throat> and then up here we have the uh, the police plaza. Check out the top, it's got a helicopter with a rotating blades on it, which is really cool. And all those flashing LEDs. Tell me that's not a cool building. If you want a big, huge police department on your layout. And that thing is a hundred bucks. That's a heck of a building for a hundred bucks. Figures, got the police dog in there. Very nice. This is a nice looking building too. This is the Oak Point Nuclear Power Facility. Check out that thing. Look at all the detail on that fence. Signage, figures, Menard's dog again. And I'm sure there's probably lights on the top but I can't quite see it. It's not lit up right now anyways. Here's a nice looking tide 
storage tanks. Again, 100 bucks for that one. Here's a HO scale. Just is the engine Cripple Creek works. It's got a couple blinking lights on top. You could put some track in there, park a couple train engines in there. Freight cars. Pretty cool. Check this out. This is the HO scale. It's got the electronic signs there. Lighting, really nice. And oh, here's the Oak Point Nuclear Power Facility all a fat facility <laughs> all lit up. It's like a disco ball. It's pretty cool. <laughs> and then here is the O scale UFO. It's like the M and M's version. You can see it's got M and M figures on it. Alien figures and the alien ship is extracting an M and M off the ground. <laughs> Pretty funny. Let's see, what else did we miss over here? I feel like I, I skipped over something. I found something that I missed on the first pass. <laughs> this is the uh, the Valley Ford dealership. That is a heck of a nice looking building. It's got some, some old Ford trucks there. Nice truck in the window. Pretty cool. I'm not sure the price on this one. It says um, oh, that's not the that's not the right price down there. I'm guessing this is probably about 100 bucks or 130 maybe, somewhere in that range. Pretty nice. Oh look, I found something that'll fit in my brown paper bag for my 15% off. Wait till the end of the video to find out what it is. So another cool thing that I missed is this church. You can see that this one's in the box. You can't really quite see it, but pretty good price. It's uh, 60 bucks. You can also get the HO scale version for 40 bucks. It says it's uh, fully landscaped and ready to place in your layout. It's a pretty nice building for, for that price. Another cool thing you can get here if you're you know, looking for a nice little starter set. You get these Bachman sets that they sell here. It's a nice uh, Union Pacific set there with uh, with the uh, F7. Pretty cool. So yeah, there's a lot of nice stuff here. There's a nice Santa Fe gondola. I don't know if I saw that the first time around. So step back and take a look at it. Pretty awesome. Here's a nice little Amtrak station. It says it has four animated Amtrak signs, 30 LEDs, all the, the figures and detailing, and it's uh, $79.99. It's a nice, nice looking building. All right, guys. I uh, found some something in the brown bag. I was able to fit something in the brown bag and he told me I wasn't allowed to keep the brown bag I gotta get a plastic bag anyways here's what I got I got the American materials sanding and cement tower since my layout's pretty limited on space it looks like this doesn't take up much space it just goes over the track and that is gonna be perfect can't wait to check that out oh and I almost forgot we couldn't leave Menards again without getting candy. This time it was Swedish fish. <laughs> well guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, trip and walk through Menards today. And we got some uh, a cool item for the train layout and I'm looking forward to using that. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you guys next time. Take care.